Hi, Collective. It's morning time where I'm at, okay? But good morning, right? Thank you guys for all the continued support. Bookings, like, shares, comments, subscribes, recommendations, tips, all that. I really appreciate it. Do you know what we're here for, girl? What's up with the planets, okay? Mercury has entered the sign of Cancer, and it will be in the sign of Cancer from July 5th until July 19th. Mercury don't like to stay in no zodiac sign for too long, okay? So this is basically like a bi-weekly for everyone, Yes. Thank you guys for all the continued support. Bookings, like, shares, comments, subscribes, recommendations, tips, all that. I really appreciate it. Two bookcase person are with me. My price and my contact information is in the description box down below. All other info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. Make sure that you are liking the video and subscribing to the channel because it keeps me in what y'all? this y'all. You see that forehead, girl? So, a little bit of background with Mercury and Cancer. Mercury and Cancer is intuitive as fuck. So please don't be surprised if you find yourself wanting to move based off of, you know, how you're feeling. Also, you know, be warned about that, all right? Because, you know, our emotions ain't always right. That's why intuition is always important. But don't be surprised if you can easily pick up on emotional cues from yourself, others. It's like being able to tell to where, you know, I don't really feel all that good. Maybe I shouldn't be around people. Maybe I need to take a rest. Maybe I need to eat. Okay. Just don't be surprised if you're able to better pick up on certain emotional cues that you have or from others. All right. It's like your intuition could be going crazy during this transit. Kind of feeling like it's heightened. Okay. I think that might be the side of heightened intuition. All right. So what we're going to do, because it's only happening over the next few weeks, we're going to pull one weekly oracle message to see what your overall energy is during this time all right and then we're gonna do a spread for y'all all right spirit guys how is this mercury and cancer transit affecting the collective july 5th until july 19th in the year 2022 excuse me now nah, booty up Mm, nah. How is Mercury and Cancer Transit affecting the collective July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022? Damn, y'all, let me pick. Excuse me. <laughs> so, I'm ready to talk to you. Came out. Collective. So... Either you're wanting to converse it with someone or someone wants to converse it with you. What I say about the intuition, divinely led and guided. So, yes, I feel like a lot of you guys, if you are able to tap in strongly enough, you'll be able to pick up on certain cues, certain signs, confirmations that you are receiving from God, the higher power, the universe, all that. All right, just don't be surprised if, like I said, heightened intuition could be a really big thing for you over these next few weeks, okay? Collective, there's someone here who I feel like is getting all sorts of signs, symbols, confirmations to talk to you. Or collective, you're getting all sorts of signs, symbols, and confirmations to talk to someone. Girl, I don't have time for it, but we'll see. <laughs> we can see what's going on. Hi, man. Okay, specifically fire sign men. King of Wands is showing up on the bottom of the deck. Oh. Four of Cups with the King of Wands. So, fire signs, water signs. Either you are missing someone or someone is missing you. Fire signs, I'm going to be honest. Um, I think there could be a water sign that could be thinking about you during this time. But I feel like you have your back to them during this time. It's like, I don't want to be bothered with you. All right? Look. Well, <laughs> on, you know, when I place it down on the table, it looks like this. All right? But... So, I guess it could go vice versa. It's that mirror and shit, okay? There are some fire signs that have water signs thinking about them. And there are some um, water signs that have fire signs thinking about them, all right? I see someone here could be bored with a certain situation with someone. Heavy on the water, heavy on the fire, all right? I see there are some people here who are either bored, okay? Things are very routine, mundane on their side of town, all right? Well, this is, you know what I'm saying? A tornado flew around my room before you came. Okay? Somebody here thinking about you, missing you, wondering about you, girl. Okay? But some of y'all are standoffish or come on standoffish towards someone here who I feel like, you know, be thinking about you, girl. Or you to someone or someone to you.
I'm going to sing it because it came to mind. Some of y'all might find yourself being reminded of someone who I feel like has been thinking about you. It's that Mercury and Cancer energy, all right? Two of Swords and Death. Okay, this shit right here. Ooh. So, air signs and water signs. I see some of you guys contemplating a certain ending during this time. You have the fork in the road trying to figure out whether or not you're going to go left or right. Some of y'all got to figure out um, what journey and or course that you're about to take during this time. But I feel like something here needs to be left alone. All right. Yeah, some of y'all, it could be that boredom energy with the four of cups. Okay, things being very routine, very mundane. Some of y'all, if you want to get out of that death card, you got to let something go. All right, a mentality, two of swords, a way of doing, a way of thinking, a way of feeling, four of cups. Spirit guys, how is Mercury and Cancer transit affecting the collective July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022? Eight of Pentacles, I'm grinding. Okay, a lot of you guys are really focused on work during this time. To be honest with you, a lot of you guys over these next few weeks ain't nothing gonna get in the way of my goals right now. Earth signs, I'm seeing this going heavy for y'all. Some of y'all are trying to achieve something, reach something, obtain something. And I feel like that's where your focus is right now. All right? Yeah. Tower card is on the bottom of the deck. I don't know. Some of y'all might experience some like um, unexpected things happening over these next few weeks that kind of like could throw you off a little bit. All right. I don't know. Some of y'all, your car might break down. Your tire might pop. Um, some repairs. And it's like something here unexpected happens that kind of like causes like a shakeup in regards to your job, in regards to your goals. Just be prepared for this girl. I, I, I see it. Okay. Yeah. Ten of Wands and the Tower card. This could be, you know, um, like I said, I see some of y'all might need some repairs in regards to something. Some of y'all could be working to get that. All right. I don't know. Some of y'all could be actually like, like you work on shit. Like, you know, this could be someone here who repairs cars, um, reconditions things. All right. I'm seeing this for earth and fire signs. Right. But I see some of y'all with the Ten of Wands and the Tower card on the bottom of the deck. A lot of y'all could have a lot of things, um, kind of feel like a lot of things are piled up on you during this time, or feeling like there's a lot on your shoulders, but with the Eight of Pentacles, no limit soldier, I thought I told you, I thought you knew, okay, a lot of you guys are really pushing through a lot of unexpected circumstances, um, pretty well during this time, alright, it's like, I gotta stay focused, okay, <laughs> a lot of y'all like, I have to stay focused, right? What came out? King of Wands and the Four of Cups. That could be an energy of like, I don't really feel like it and I don't give a fuck, okay? It could come off like that. A lot of y'all are trying your best not to be in that energy or are being urged to not be in that energy. Spirit guys, how's the Mercury and Cancer transit affecting the collective July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022? My phone. Page of Pentacles. So, Earth signs. Am I just doing a, a reading for you, girl? I mean, Mercury is a heavy Earth has a heavy Earth sign influence, and you know, Cancer is you know water, uh, Moon. Okay, we're okay. Page of Pentacles. Yeah, a lot of you guys with the Eight of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles are offer <laughs> are offer an opportunity, a venture, a certain like. I'm sticking to this plan. All right. A lot of you guys are trying to work through some sort of plan during this time. Like I said, a lot of you guys are really just focused on work. Um, or trying to uh, maintain or stick to a certain routine. Yeah, girl, 10 of wands. A lot of y'all got a lot of shit on your plate. Okay. I don't know if you eat a lot. <laughs> I don't know if you eat a lot, but a lot of you guys definitely have a lot of things to take care of during this time. And I see with the Eight of Pentacles, tackle everything one by one. Page of Pentacles is a seed. Some of you guys need to be careful about wanting to take on everything at once. Don't do that to yourself because you're going to burn out. Tower card, you know, you're going to fall out, girl, in the middle of the street. Do you have your life alert on? All right, some of y'all need to be careful about putting too much shit on top of you girl and i'm seeing this for the earth and the fire signs you need to stop girl okay yeah i got ace of swords and the ace of pentacles out here um a lot of you guys could be in this mentality i'm seeing this heavy with the earth signs okay um a lot of you guys are kind of in this uh mentality where it's like ace of pentacles and the ten of wands whatever it is whatever type of job that you have whatever sort of business venture opportunity that you have ten of wands it does come with a lot of hard work but i feel like with the page of pentacles and the eight of pentacles it's like bro, i'm ready i asked for this so you know i gotta put it put it in work okay 
all big titties, lift your shirt. So we'll play you what you work. I just played that on my story. That's wild, G. And while you're focused, okay, on financial mentors, okay, stability mentors, there's someone here outside your energy who I feel like is thinking about you. Okay, four cups and a five of cups. I'm going to be honest. I really feel like five plus four equals nine of cups. This person tries to be satisfied and content with whatever it is that's going on in their life. But I did not. I, I feel like this person wants some new new. <laughs> now, I feel like this person wants like a change in their life. Okay, remember how that two of swords and the death card came out? I see some air signs and some water signs going through this. Okay, kind of like wanting things to be different in their life, but with the page of cups here. I don't, I, I so I don't, I don't know. I don't, it's giving me Peter Parker type tease, girl, before he was Spider Man. Okay, some of y'all need to be careful about being in this industry where it's like you know you need to change, you know there needs to be a certain shift that happens in your life, and you kind of just stand in there. All right. Like, you know, well, girl, if it happens, it happens. Excuse you. We didn't make it happen. Capping out here, collective. Spirit, guys, how is Mercury and Cancer Transit affecting the collective? July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022. Emperor. Okay, girl. Hi, man. Okay, Eight of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, and the Emperor. Some of you guys own your own business. Some of y'all, I'm seeing wear different hats. Some of y'all could own your own business. You work a nine to five. You are a parent, okay? I just see that some of y'all, girl, I don't really have a lot of time for the kitty shit, all right? I don't know. Somebody here might have to take their child to work. I mean, girl, they, they making it happen, okay? They like, I ain't gonna miss out on no money, okay? Little Pablo just gonna have to come with me, all right? But I don't know. All right, but I do see someone here really trying to maintain parenthood and uh, work, Okay? Like I said, they could be taking their child within the meetings and shit like that. Six of Wands is on the, on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, fire and earth signs. I really see a lot of you guys handling it, all right? A lot of you guys have been given a certain opportunity or there's a certain list of goals, achievements that you're trying to uh, accomplish right now. You, you, you on one, all right? A lot of you guys are really like, nah, girl, I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it, okay? There's also someone here that sees you like this. There's someone here that sees a lot of potential in you, earth and water signs. Some of y'all, this could be somebody at your job. This could be a boss or a manager or a supervisor being like, yeah, that motherfucker gonna go places. Some of y'all, someone here sees the potential in you. But not just because we can see the potential in somebody all day, every day. But it's what they doing with the potential. A lot of you guys, someone here sees potential in you and it's like, nah, I think we can do something with that. Some of y'all, this is either a job um, somebody reaching out to you through like marketing or something like that. Okay, somebody here wants to utilize your talents, collective. Like I said, this could be with a job, a business, offer, or opportunity. Some of y'all are looked at like this in regards to business and work. It's like, damn, yo, you really about your business. You better fucking believe it, bitch. All right. <laughs> a lot of y'all might find yourself, um, more submerged in your masculine energy, whether you are a woman or a man or however you identify, right? Mm -hmm. King of Wands, Six of Wands, and the Ace of Wands on the bottom of my day. Yeah. Because the King of Wands for me is the tier below Emperor. He's not quite an Emperor yet, but he could be on his way. Yeah, I see a lot of you guys, Eight of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, and the Emperor. I'm going to put in the work. I'm going to I'm gonna have some late nights. I'm going to have some early mornings, but I'm going to get this shit done. Some of y'all, there's some people outside of you, Ace of Wands, King of Wands, and the Six of Wands who just want the, the look of being successful. Two of Pentacles. They playing with this shit. They real inconsistent with it. No disrespect, but I could see this going for some Leos. Okay? Here reason that like they got it down back. All right, but I do see some fire signs out here and earth signs kind of just wanting to look the part of being successful, looking like they got their shit in the bag. And there's some people here who's really like, nah, bro, like I really get my hands dirty. Oh. So be careful. Spirit guys, how is Mercury and Cancer Transit affecting the collective July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022? Which are you? Okay. You know, I really want to talk to some other people, Earth signs. Okay. <laughs> Four of Pentacles. 
some of y'all money could be a little bit tight during this time but i feel like with the eight of pentacles and the page of pentacles it could be because you're putting your money towards other things during this time so you could have a little bit less disposable income to work with over these next few weeks all right we got the four of pentacles so we got halvesies we got eight of pentacles and the four of pentacles out here with the eight of cups on the bottom of the deck I see there could be someone in here holding on to something that with the Eight of Cups and the Nine of Pentacles, they might really want to walk away from. I'm seeing this going heavy with a Taurus, okay, and water signs. It's like, could be holding on to a certain way of doing things, a certain situation or a certain uh, person, Right, so where it's like, I really kind of like don't want to be a part of this anymore. But with the Four of Pentacles, I feel like I got to stay in it. All right, but you kind of, you know, half-assing it. You went from the Eight of Pentacles to a four, to the Four of Pentacles. I don't know, Collective, you need to be careful about half-assing something during the sign. Where it's like, I mean, girl, if you're not going to be all in, why are you there anyway? Bars, all right? Yeah, Justice card is out here. I see this going for some air signs, earth, and water, okay? Really only Taurus. Okay, that's the only earth sign I see really going through that. Okay, but I see water, Taurus, and air signs going through this. It's like, I really don't want to be in this situation, be a part of this. But with the eight of swords, I can't really figure out how to move forward or move in another direction. Okay, three eights is out here. Eight of pentacles, eight of cups, and the eight of swords. Somebody here needs to be careful about, you know, being on the hamster wheel. And I mean, it's like, you know, you think about this, you think about doing that, but you don't really change nothing. A lot of you guys might be very low key about all the different projects, ventures, ideas, um, visions, um, achievements that you have uh, on the on the table during this time. It's like not everybody need to know that. I'm seeing some of y'all keep you know certain things hidden from um, like if you have like a nine to five, it's like you you don't like your nine to five to know everything that you got going on in your life. Which duh, okay. So yeah, guys, how is this? Girl, where are we at? <laughs> How is this Mercury and Cancer transit affecting the collective July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022? Ace of Swords. Okay, girl, with the Five of Cups. Yeah. Okay, girl, we're going to get a little bit, you know, a little sentimental, okay? Some of y'all, there's someone here that I feel like you don't mess with. Four Pentacles and the Ace of Swords you don't talk to, you don't look at, you don't, well, I would say you don't worry about. You know, but, you know, can't go that far. <laughs> Through the Page of Pentacles here, you might still, you know, like, care about somebody. But I kind of feel like you have definitely disassociated or detached yourself from a specific person. All right. Heavy on the water. Okay. Uh, earth and air signs. A lot of you guys have done this with a water. Yeah. Earth, air, and fire signs. A lot of you guys have done this with a water sign. All right, I just sort of feel like that's not where your focus is right now. And with the five of cups, I really think this person wants to talk to you, whoever this is. Some of y'all, there's someone here that you know, low key, you kind of like, I don't want to say you bossed up on, but that's what I said. All right, but I feel like you bossed up on this person the way it's just like, I mean, girl, you're not my life. Okay, <laughs> so you know, it's like, I mean, girl, if you exit, the, the show must go on, honey. Okay. It's like somebody here could be a little bit disappointed in the fact that you that you kind of look like you're doing well without them. It's like, was I the problem, girl? Maybe. Okay. <laughs> Some of y'all, there's someone here who I feel like is a little bit disappointed in the fact that you seem to be doing a lot better without them. So, here, guys, how is this Mercury and Cancer transit affecting the collective July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022? A lot of y'all might be practicing. A lot of y'all might be practicing um, minimalism. All right, four of pentacles, ace of swords with the page of swords. Like looking, uh, paying attention to what you can not do without, but what you really don't need right now. So some of y'all, this could be controlling your portions in regards to your diet. Some of y'all, this could anything in regards to finances. Like whatever you put money into, it's like if I don't really need that, I need to buy that right now. A lot of you guys are gonna be like, you know what? I'm gonna go without it. Eight of Pentacles. It's like, I mean, if that's what I got to do to make shit work right now, then that's what I'm going to do. Because like I said, with the Four of Pentacles out here, a lot of you guys' money could be tight. I feel like you could be getting money. Okay, you get, get into the money. Okay, but I feel like money could be tight for a lot of you guys during this time. All right. Four of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, and the Page of Swords. Uh, Earth and Air signs. Some of y'all, there's someone here that I feel like is... You, you, Lord, 
A lot of you guys got a lot of nosy individuals around you. It's like the more low-key you become or try to be a lot more nosy people get with you. Page of Swords is out here, all right? Some of y'all could be saving money for... Could be traveling. Page of Pentacles with the Ace of Swords. Maybe flights. Um, you know, reservations or something like that. Some of y'all could be putting money aside for that. That could be why money is tight, all right? Some of y'all could be looking for a new um, electronic uh, gadget or vehicle. So maybe you want to buy a computer, a laptop, a phone, a tablet, um, an appliance. Okay, a lot of you guys, I feel like, are putting money aside to buy um, certain um, electronics, right? Oh, yeah, I told you. I <laughs> bet so somebody here is out here watching you, okay? Um, earth, air, and fire signs. I definitely see someone here, you know, looking at you. I told you, some of y'all, this is like people seeing the potential, potential in you, whether it be um, business matters, um, career matters, okay? And just people outside of you. A lot of y'all, people see like, damn, yo, they about their business, okay? You a boss. Now, I'm going to be honest, that, uh, I don't, some of y'all really don't understand or realize the influence that you have over people like the emperor girl. People looking, people are looking at the emperor, all right, whether you are a man or a woman, this masculine energy that you, a lot of you guys are radiating during this time, a lot of people are paying attention to that and seeing you really like be able to take control of your life, all right? It's like, I'm not waiting for nobody to hand me nothing. I'm going to go get it, Okay. Yeah. Seven of Pentacles, Two of Swords, and the Queen of Swords. Some of y'all have people looking at you to where it's like they just sitting there waiting for something to come to them. Seven of Swords and the Nine of Cups kind of lying about being satisfied and or content about where they're at. No disrespect to them, girl. This is real shit. All right? It's like a lot of you guys have people looking at you, seeing you like put in the hard work, seeing you kind of like be able to maintain different things in your life, whether you are a parent, whether you are a business owner, whether you just, you know what I'm saying? I'm just a squirrel trying to get a nut right now. You know, you just, you're trying to, you know, handle your business, all right? Like I said, a lot of you guys don't understand the power and the influence that you have towards others, but I feel like it's because you're grinding, okay? You're not really focused on who looking at you, but you do have people looking at you. A lot of people are nosy, wanting to see what you got going on, all right? I don't know what the Page of Pentacles, some of y'all could have something, you know, in the works during this time, whether it be a project, a venture, or an opportunity. People know. It's like people know whenever you get a little bit low-key, you know what I mean? Or whenever you start moving a certain way, people know you got something up underneath your sleeve. Damn, girl, what season are you on? Okay, Spirit Guys, how is this Mercury and Cancer transit affecting the collective? July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022. This is also, you know, someone here that I feel like wants to talk to you. Like, what you got going on over there? I was waiting for you to show up, girl. Okay, <laughs> Queen of Cups. I water signs. Ace of Pentacles. I see some earth water signs maybe realizing that a certain like connection with someone it could be a commitment or a marriage really ain't what they thought it was going to be. This could be someone here thinking that maybe like a marriage hired fan, the Ace of Pentacles is going to be real grand. You know, girl, marriage ain't fun. All right, girl, we're not getting married for fun. No, <laughs> nah, but that's you basically committing to someone saying like, no matter what happens in life, girl, we're not going to split up because we love each other. All right, I do see some earth signs and water signs realizing that maybe you're not in that space with a certain person. All right. I see some Virgos, some Taurus, some Scorpios, okay? Any water sign, really, uh, going through this during this time. Death card, three of swords, and a higher fan. My condolences to anybody that has lost anyone as of recently. I do see some of y'all could have lost someone. Yeah. I definitely see some fire, water, and air signs, specifically Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Gemini, um, any fire sign, really. Um, kind of like keeping it, like... 
some people are keeping it uh low key things that they're pursuing during this time, like things that they have in the works, projects, ventures, opportunities, all that. I see some people here keeping it low key that they want to pursue other things, right? This could be being with someone and you know, secretly being like, I don't want to deal with you no more, but you know, I'm gonna fake the funk for right now. I see some people here worried about it. somebody here having nightmares. Yeah, somebody here might feel like stuck, trapped, restrained in a certain situation. And they could be having like nightmares or just, you know, dreams that's really bothering them to where it's like, excuse me, them getting out of a certain situation. Some some people, this is God. Okay, higher fan, three of swords and a death card. It's like God giving you a reality check in regards to how you're doing things, what you're committing to, what you're involved in. It's like he's sending signs where it's like, listen, girl. It might be telling the ladies go, okay? Spirit guys, how is this Mercury and Cancer transit affecting the collective July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022? Nine of Wands. Good girl. Whoa, I see why, okay? Devil card is on the bottom of the deck. Page of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, and the Nine of Wands. A lot of you guys, I feel like there could be some envy, jealousy outside you during this time. That's why with the Nine of Wands, you're very protective and are guarded about certain ventures, projects, or opportunities that you had during this time. Because you do have some Welch's great bitches outside of you. I'm not even going to lie to you, okay? Uh, water signs and fire signs. Some of you guys need to be careful about being tempted by something, okay? Keep your guards up. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Some of y'all, this could be sexual. Lust? Some of y'all could uh, feel like uh, you're being tempted uh, with lust during this time. A lust could be an issue for you. Greed, desires, okay? Anything in excess, right? Um, I'm seeing, you know, water, fire, and earth signs dealing with this. Maybe some air signs. Girl, if it apply to you, it apply to you, girl. Y'all trying to have me do specifics, okay? So it's like, Page of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords, you get handed a certain opportunity. You know where you want to go. You're driven to get something done, get something handled, obtain something. And this motherfucker want to come out the woodworks like, I bet you can't do it. I bet you want that, don't you? It's like, bitch, if you don't go somewhere, damn, let me do my thing. Some of y'all, that's how y'all feel. Okay, some like um, negative energy outside of you could be like trying to get you to, you know, be like, you shouldn't do it. It ain't going to happen. You should just go ahead and you know what I'm saying? Smoke that cocaine. <laughs> Smoke the cocaine. I want to say crack. I don't know why cocaine comes out. I don't know somebody here having a problem with drugs. I don't know, man. Okay. Maybe drinking too much because there are cups out here. Yeah. But like I said, some of y'all are very guarded against someone during the time who I feel like, you know, be thinking about you. But they could be toxic or this could be someone here the way you like, nah, girl, you carry toxic energy. You yourself might not be toxic, but you got that toxic energy that I can't have around me during this time. Some of y'all, there is someone here watching you like this. Sorry, y'all. Getting a little bit distracted. Some of y'all could be celibate and there's someone here that wants you. <laughs> earth and fire, uh, earth, fire and water. I'm seeing this heavy for y'all, okay? You could be celibate or not really trying to fuck with someone during this time and it's making them want you, want you more, all right? They think about you when they go to bed. It, they just kind of like, just you, you, you're you always on my mind, okay? You always on their mind, all right? This person want to talk to you. I don't know what the five of cups for shame. This person might feel like they can't really approach you for some reason. I see why, because the emperor card is out here. It's like, they know they can't bring this bullshit to you, devil card. Plus, with the king of wands and the emperor, this person might be a little bit intimidated by you. What what, what you got going on, right? Yeah. I, ah, yeah, I just saw the seven of wands and the devil card. So, earth signs and fire signs, I feel like a lot of you guys are really like, you know, girl, thou shalt not pass, okay? Get thee behind me, Satan. Spirit guys, last card. How is this Mercury and Cancer transit affecting the collective July 5th until July 19th in the year 2022? I'm going to do like a little overview wrap up, okay? Ooh, okay. Water park. Okay, but this is also staying hydrated, my friends, but taking care of yourself as well. Ooh. Ten of swords on the bottom of my desk. What we got going on here? 
So let me see if I can go through everybody. So water signs and fire signs. Queen of Cups, Nine of Wands, and the Ace of Cups. A lot of you guys might find yourself being a lot more guarded in regards to your emotions, um, who you're pouring into during this time. It's just like I'm very selective about who I have around me, um, what I involve myself in during this time. A lot of you guys are trying to, you know what I'm saying, uh, be clean. So I don't know. This could be someone here who's trying to stay away from drugs, trying to stay away from alcohol, but it ain't got to be just that. This could be you, you know what I'm saying? Not uh, eating unhealthy. Um, you not being around toxic people or certain uh, toxic situations. Okay. Circumstances. All right. Eight of Pentacles and the Four of Pentacles. If I want to make this work, I got to stay away from this or I got to cut back on this. Right. I do see Ace of Swords and the Four of Pentacles. Y'all cutting something out. Page of Swords, something that doesn't belong, something that doesn't fit, something that, you know what I'm saying, you just can't have with you during this time, all right? Fire, water, and air signs. Either you're watching someone make it happen or somebody here is watching you make it happen, okay? Some of y'all definitely with the Ace of Cups have a, a, a powerful influence, man. It's like people look at you, take care of yourself, love yourself, pour into yourself, and they like... Okay, it's noticeable, right? I see someone here scared about something ending. Moon card, nine of swords, ace of pentacles, and the ten of swords. Somebody here knows that they need to let something go. I see somebody here knowing this about a job. Uh, page of swords and the emperor card. Seeing it, it's time for them to really like settle down in their career. Settle down to own their own business. Um, or, you know, pursuing that, right? There's someone here needing to take the reins on their life, right? I see someone here. Um, yeah, it's like someone here knows that something here is coming to an end. I see water signs, uh, air signs going through this the heaviest. A little bit of earth, yeah. Earth, water, and air signs are going through this. Like knowing that something here is coming to an end with the Ace of Pentacles as a blessing and something here coming to an end. With the moon card and dinosaurs, they could be scared about what happens after that. Like, what happens whenever I decide to walk away from this, terminate this, let this go? What's going to happen? Some of y'all, there's someone here who I feel like kind of fumbled you, let you go, girl. You know, you said you was leaving. They was like, okay, don't let the door hit you on the way out. <laughs> Some of y'all, there's someone here that definitely let you go who I feel hasn't really gotten over that. It's like watching you blow up, watching you kind of just really take control of your life. And they like, damn, bro. Damn. Damn. <laughs> I see either a water, air, or earth sign feeling like this, okay? Or water, air sign, and earth sign. Somebody here is feeling like this towards you. All right, girl, I got to get up out of here because we are on a schedule. Collective, that was your Mercury and Cancer transit. It was a collective reading, girl. Okay, you don't have to have Mercury and Cancer to be up in here. Don't put that in the comments. You ain't that. Girl, what I say? All right. Like the video, leave a comment telling me if it's resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. My pricing and my content information will be in the description box down below to book a personal tarot reading with me. All the info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. All right, y'all. I will holler. All right, y'all don't catch me uh, at the end of this week because I got to release uh, the rest of the July monthlies, okay? <laughs> I'm going to talk to you later, all right? <laughs> Bye.